Okay, it's working now. Go Okay, ahead. so we're going, we need to get the heat out of the ground and bring it into the uh, building here. So we have the water lines out in the uh, wells uh, outside, and we're going to pump that water in here. Here is one of the uh, piping uh, connect systems connected to outside. So we're bringing the water in here, and it's coming in right now at about 45 degrees. And we bring the water down into our system at 45 degrees, and that water goes into a coil down by the uh, compressor that's inside the uh, uh, water furnace system there. So um, we uh, have a, uh, a coil in there. And right next, molded next to that coil, is a, another coil with refrigerant. And that refrigerant passes by right as the water passes by and picks up a little bit of the water's temperature. Uh, about typically you know, four to six degrees of uh, temperature we mm -hmm. get out of the water. Um, it pulls it out of there. Uh, the compressor brings it up to the uh, blower area, and then we, we release that heat off of the uh, refrigerant into the uh, duct system and move the heat into the house there. Uh, the water circuit now has lost some of its heat and starts coming out of uh, the system, and it's about 40 degrees here. Mm -hmm. uh, so we've now taken five degrees out of this out of the earth there in this circuit and are bringing it back out into the field to now be regenerated with heat in this in this continual process now we've that same water goes through the entire circuit and we bring it back in it picks up uh, uh, those couple degrees out in the yard there we then um, do the whole process over and over again till we have the house up to a uh, uh, comfortable temperature, you know, 70 degrees, for example. Um, and and it's, uh, that's how it works.